Well, experts in South Africa have also hailed the visit to the United Kingdom by the Chinese president. Here is what Sam had to say. I think no one is interested in denying uh, the footprint that China has on the international markets uh, on the continent. As you correctly say, that uh, it is considered to be Africa's largest trading partner, uh, displacing the European Union, displacing countries from the north. And this visit that we are seeing, the impending visit of the Chinese president to UK, is very consistent with uh, China's buoyancy, China's uh, uh, clear presence in the global uh, uh, atmosphere. And I think that uh, Western countries are also beginning to acknowledge that uh, things have changed. Perhaps the terms of trade have changed, the global uh, uh, sphere has actually changed, and therefore China's visit to UK is of great significance. The six top-selling Apple stores in the world are all based in China. China's middle class has been growing immensely, and that is something that the UK and the US have seen and have acknowledged, and that's why they are building these relationships with China. Our own government has, as we all know, also been growing relationships with uh, mainland China, but and something that we do want to emphasize is that you can't do that and push away other countries like the West.